Welcome to our step-by-step -step guide on building a transformer pad. In this video, we'll walk you through the critical steps needed to ensure safety, stability, and compliance with local regulations. Whether you're a professional or a DIY enthusiast, this guide will help you build a reliable transformer pad. Let's get started. First, choose a suitable location. Make sure it meets local zoning regulations, offers easy maintenance access, and is free from obstructions and hazards like flooding or heavy traffic. Next, prepare the site by clearing debris, vegetation, and obstacles. Level the ground to create a stable base. Then, excavate to a depth of 8 to 12 inches, depending on soil conditions and load requirements. Construct wooden or metal forms to shape the concrete pad. Ensure they are secure and level. Add a four to six inch layer of compacted gravel or crushed stone to the excavated area for stability and drainage. Reinforce the pad with rebar or wire mesh. Use a high quality concrete mix with a compressive strength of at least 3000 PSI. Pour the concrete evenly within the forms, removing any air pockets, and smooth the surface with a trowel. Create a slight slope for water runoff. Allow the concrete to cure properly by keeping it moist for at least seven days. Use wet burlap, plastic sheeting, or a curing compound to retain moisture. This step is crucial for the pad's strength and durability. Install grounding rods and ensure proper bonding according to local electrical codes. This is essential for safety and helps prevent electrical faults. Finally, inspect the pad for any cracks or defects to ensure it meets all specifications and standards. Once it's fully cured and inspected, you can, you can install the transformer and connect it according to the manufacturer's instructions and local regulations. And there you have it, a durable and compliant transformer pad ready for use. By following these steps, you can ensure the safe and efficient operation of your pad-mounted transformers. Um, thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more practical guides.